When we have two parallel lines that are intersected by a transversal, and again, my parallel lines I identify by using the same number of arrows, then two special angles are congruent, and that is alternate interior angles. So let's examine these two words. Alternate means on opposite sides. Interior means within or in between. So here we have our two parallel lines. Our alternate interior angles are going to be the angles that are inside and on opposite sides of the transversal. So angle 4 is inside and its opposite side would be 6. So those two angles will be congruent. There's only one other pair of alternate interior angles, and that's angle 3, and its opposite side in between the parallel lines, which is 5. So alternate interior angles will always be congruent, and they'll always be on opposite sides of this transversal.